Foundation. When revolutionary Dr. Harry Selden predicts the imminent fall of the empire, he and a group of loyal followers travel to the far reaches of the galaxy to establish the Foundation, in an attempt to rebuild and preserve the future of civilization. Enraged by Harry's theories, the Cleons, a long line of succession of clone emperors in power, fear that their control over the galaxy could weaken and must recognize the very real possibility of losing their legacy forever. Series of 10 episodes. If you like science fiction, this series is for you. The story may be at first somewhat complicated and difficult to understand, but as it unfolds, the plot becomes clearer, keeping you interested and entertained throughout each episode. The performances of the entire cast are good, as well as the cinematography, special effects, and other production elements. This series is a good adaptation of Isaac Asimov's novel of the same name and it's worth watching, so we give it 3 stars out of 5. Hawkeye It narrates the adventures of Hawkeye from the point of view of Clint Barton's successor, Kate Bishop, one of the members of the group of Young Avengers. Miniseries of 6 episodes. This miniseries from the Marvel Universe is just another production made for superhero fans and it's worth watching if this is your favorite genre. The story so far, watching the first three episodes, is interesting enough to watch but far from being spectacular. The performances are decent as are most of the production elements. For being similar to all other Marvel productions that in the end make you have a good time, we give it 3 stars out of 5. Invasion An alien attack that affects the entire Earth is shown from the point of view of characters scattered across different continents. Series of 10 episodes During the first episodes, the story unfolds in a very slow manner. So much so that we almost stopped watching this series as it was boring. But halfway through the season, the story finally becomes interesting and with a good dose of drama and suspense. So we decided to keep watching it to see how this first season ends. Overall, the performances are decent, although there are certain characters who are hard to like and are simply dull. Production elements such as set designs and special effects are good. Due to the value we give to the overall story and for how it unfolds from the fourth episode onwards, we give it 3 stars out of 5 instead of 2. Kin A boy is killed and his family embarks on a gangland war with an international cartel. But the Kinsellas have something the cartel does not. The unbreakable bonds of blood and family. Series of 8 episodes. This series, full of intrigue, drama and suspense, can be raw at times, but that is to be expected in productions of this genre. If you like stories about organized crime, the mafia, mafia families like the Corleone, or productions like that, this series is for you. The performances and other production elements are all good, and the story is well showcased. So we give it 3 stars out of 5. La Brea A huge sinkhole mysteriously opens up in Los Angeles, separating part of a family in an inexplicable primitive world, along with a disparate group of strangers. Series of 10 episodes. The story in itself is original and interesting, although, honestly, there are some parts that seem exaggerated, hard to believe, predictable, slow, and somewhat dull, but overall, the story keeps you intrigued and in suspense. The opening scenes of the first episode hook you to the series almost immediately, and you find yourself wanting to know more about this mystery. 
the performances of the entire cast are decent, as are the production elements such as the cinematography, set designs and special effects. But the CGI generated animals are bad and some even mediocre. For being a series that at least keeps you interested and entertained, we give it 3 stars out of 5. The Girl in the Woods Carrie is a mysterious warrior who escaped from a cult colony that protects the world from monsters hidden behind a secret door in the forest. Series of 8 episodes. This series has an original and interesting story which entertains you throughout each episode, although there are some parts that are somewhat slow that might bore you. Nevertheless, the performances, scenography and the special effects are decent, and for being a series that actually keeps you entertained, we give it 3 stars out of 5. The Sex Lives of College Girls Series that revolves around four roommates and students from New England's prestigious Essex College. A bundle of contradictions and hormones, these girls are equal parts lovable and infuriating as they live out their new, free lives on campus. Series of 10 episodes. The story in this series is not that original since it's similar to other productions that explore the same theme, but it's interesting and entertaining enough to watch. Keep in mind that there is nudity, scenes of sexual content, and use of offensive language. The performances of the entire cast are good and credible. We have seen the first episodes and, honestly, this is a series that is fun to watch, so we give it 3 stars out of 5. The Wheel of Time Set in a vast and epic world where magic exists and only a few women can access it, the story follows Moraine, a member of an incredibly powerful women's organization called Aes Sedai, as she arrives in the small town of Two Rivers. Series of 8 episodes. The story is not only original, but also interesting, intriguing and dramatic that hooks you from the start. The performances of the entire cast are excellent, and the production elements, such as the scenography, set designs, cinematography, special effects, and costume designs are all very good. For being a production that is worth watching, we give it 4 stars out of 5. Vigil The brilliant and fragile detective Amy Silva is sent to the submarine HMS Vigil to investigate the mysterious death of one of its crew. When the hatch closes above her head, the reality she encounters is very different from what she expected. Within the submarine, secrecy, hierarchies and the claustrophobic scenario complicate the investigation. Mini-series of six episodes. The story is not only original, but it's extremely interesting and intriguing, loaded with a lot of suspense and drama. The performances of the entire cast are great and the production elements, such as set designs and cinematography, are all good. This British miniseries is worth watching and is very good, so we give it 4 stars out of 5. Yellow Jackets A female team of successful soccer players become the unfortunate survivors of a plane crash that crashes into Ontario's deepest and wildest wilderness. Series of 8 episodes. The plot of this series might remind you of the tragedy of the Uruguayan rugby team in the Andes, but is different in its own way. The story actually awakens in the viewer the need to find out what secrets the protagonists hide, so it makes it interesting and intriguing. Each episode hooks you more to the series. The performances of the entire cast are decent, as are most of the production elements such as set designs and special effects. 
We give this production 3 stars out of 5.